Here we have the uh, water leak video, uh, in video on the Ford Fiesta 2009. Now, uh, what led you to find the water? Um, once we bought the car, we bought it yeah. when it was in the summer, and then I wanted to have a look at the spare tyre. Right. And it had been through a car wash. Okay, yeah. And then as I looked at it, I could see that there was water. Yeah. But of course, when we bought the car, done dry, there was no sign of anything. But oh, right, yeah. This has been, someone done a crack at this before. Yeah, um, I'll explain why in a bit when we get to it. Okay, so, I guess the symptoms were the wet footwell or the wet uh, footwell, the uh, water leak. Yeah, that was all peeled up. Oh, yeah, you can see that. Yeah. Um, this was wet. Yeah, now in there. And behind there, yeah. there's water. I've had to put stuff down there. Right. That yeah. needs checking. That was a bit damp around here. Yeah, and then what we did do. When we tried to find this ourselves, we started doing the watering can trick. Yeah. And I'm pouring water all up here, and then all of a sudden the rear passenger footwell got wet. Mm, but it, yeah. that seems to have dried out since. Mm, but possibly. on rainfall, yeah. this will get water in it, even just by sitting outside in the rain. Yeah. Um, I bought a new gasket for this. Someone yeah. seriously had a go at messing around with a sealant gun behind it. There's yeah. so much sealant behind it. I just put the new rubber gasket on. I just put it about on. Yeah, that's uh, too yeah, much. Some, sometimes common on these where yeah. back in like the air vents, the rear lights, you yeah. know, the welded seams at the top there. Yeah, it's fairly common. So it was. Um, you got any suspected areas where it's coming from? Just um, messing around the I, tail lights. Possibly. When I when I peeled this back. Yeah. When I started having a bit of a look-see, uh, you can see like that. That see that's still damp yeah. now. Yeah. And see, I took it back to where we bought it, and they started to see. They just went mad with a sealant gun. Yeah. I know on these, it's, uh, James was saying it's quite common around the rear lights and the boot and the air vents. So that's probably yeah. going to be the first area I check as well. Yeah. Uh, um, and that side there, the other yeah. day, I did notice that that had a little bit of damp on it. Yeah. So, um, so not as much as that side. That side. Yeah. So as you said earlier, you've had you took it to the place you bought. And took they it back there. Sealed they it. said they were going to seal it. Yeah. I think they've just gone crazy with a black sealant gun. Yeah. Um, and they, it hasn't been fixed. I then took it back again, and then they yeah it was all done now, and it hasn't been. So in the end, I thought yeah. I, I need to find somewhere that actually yeah does something like this because they wanted me to take it back again, but they they won't. Yeah. Have. Yeah, I well, just want rid. Luckily, we specialise in these. Yeah. Fiestas and focuses are quite common. Yeah, yeah. I've, I've, even, I've done a couple of them myself, I haven't been here that long. Yeah. You know? yeah. We Water Leak found video on the 2009 Ford Fiesta. First thing we found were the door membranes were leaking. And this could end up with the water entering into the car's footwells. In the case of this car, it is actually dry underneath here. There is no water. Nothing under there. However, if it were to, you probably need to get it, uh, lift all the carpet up, suck out the water uh, to ensure that no mould forms, so no foul odours or any electrical issues where the wires are there. In addition, the welded seams were cracked, as you may be able to see just there and there, on the other side. Just lift it up there. What was happening here is the water would en enter through the crack, make its way down the pillar, and in the case here, it would come from up there onto here, and it would puddle down around here, as you can see there. We also found that the uh, rear air vents were leaking, as you can see there, they're all wet. And obviously, where you've got the material in there, that's going to collect water grow mould and possibly create a foul smell which we certainly don't want and we'll need to get rid of and prevent in the future. Progress report on the Ford Fiesta in for the water leak. As you can see so far we've taken the tower lights off and the rear bumper. We replaced the vents around here and put our sealant around it as well as the little bungs where the tower light fits into. Uh, also installed a little uh, blanking plate sort of thing there because uh, they were peeling off before as you can see same on the other side yeah uh, we also fixed the welded seams it's now sealant applied along there 
you see, get a good enough angle, both sides. And also, uh, we've taken the door cards off and the membranes to reseal them, as you can see there, there's one off. And on the other side, we have installed it, as you can see. So yeah, there's sealant running all the way along and everything's just being connected up, put back together. And hopefully it won't take much longer and it'll be all good.